congratulations bhumika on securing all india sixth rank in gate 22 computer science thank you so briefly about yourself okay so um, i studied computer engineering and in 2019 i completed it uh okay. then i uh, went ahead and did a job for two years and then i decided that i wanted to pursue mtech and that's how i decided on gate and yeah that's it. then i started studying around uh, march last year and then uh yeah i studied for almost like 9 to 10 months and then i gave the exam i think you are uh, as a deep learn student as online yeah. student with one year subscription na yeah correct yeah. i think last year nine. yeah last year january month you have taken okay yes. generally in the pre recorded videos students have some doubts how to mm-hmm. start how to schedule the mm-hmm. videos so what is the approach you followed okay so first of all i went with my gut like if i like the subject i decided that i will study it Okay. and most of the times the videos were very clear like i did not require any additional uh, assistance to getting the information so But videos were sufficient yeah for me at least and if they were not uh, i would search the internet if i have some doubts okay very uh, nice else uh, if i had some doubts i searched the internet else i would mail there was a button in the app like yeah, ask an mail. expert ask an expert yeah correct yeah So, so you are using it liberally mean, ask an expert yeah yeah uh, in the start i did but then i started studying subjects which i liked so okay. most of the doubts were like i they were not there like okay. not many doubts i had but in some okay. subjects like uh, uh, i would say cn i had a lot of doubts so okay. i think i bugged them a lot yeah <laughs> okay okay very good yeah. uh, so anyway you have your own style with which subject you started okay so yes, first i start first i started with i think probability because okay. i love that subject yeah okay. but then once the random variables came i was a little i don't know i was a little off track then i started okay. with uh, c programming like c the programming program. section yeah. i com- then i completed every subject only probability i left it in middle because uh-huh. i was like i think i need a background a little okay. bit background in maths and everything so i started then i did c uh, programming then i went to logic i think then algorithm data structures uh, then i went ahead and did coa os and then at the end i did cn yeah very and dm good. i did parallelly to other subjects very nice yeah. <laughs> We have used the test series means uh, along with your preparation, yeah. you might have written the exams, na? No? How? Mm-hmm. Uh, what is the way in which you have written the exams? Okay, so I started test series around July. I started July. test ser- giving test series around July. Uh, I did first of all I gave subject test the forty-five minute test that we yeah, have. Yeah, yeah. Fifteen questions, I think we have in that. Correct. So, Correct. Uh, if I was studying that subject, I would give the subject-wise test. There were two tests for every subject, subject-wise test. Mm, true. So I would complete that, and then um, if I have like if if the if it's a weekend, then I would give the full-length test of every subject. Like once I complete the subject, in the next weekend, I would give the full-length test. So this I did for three months, and after that, uh, once my subject test and full-length test of the subject to were finished then i moved on to the mock test the 3 hours test very good. yeah that's the strategy okay okay bhumika how many hours of videos you used to watch on a particular day so it varied because i used to watch it in 2x speed <laughs> because i was at 2x speed okay yeah okay. I, so uh, i think all together around 600 hours Mm-hmm. and together around 600 hours i think computer science okay. yeah yeah i so. i almost watched every video in 2x leaving okay. apart some subjects like cn i did it on a very slow pace slow. okay okay yeah by what and time you have completed the syllabus first round of uh, listening to the videos i think i did it around oh, september or october i did the first round completely yeah then again started then, revision 
yeah i again started revision i did because this was my first revision i had uh, like not remembered a lot of things so i had to do it very thoroughly like okay very nicely i did the second revision uh, i think the second revision lasted for two months that is okay. uh, around uh, Oh, November December November I completed it and then last two months I kept for I had a strategy in my mind like for one and a half month I would again revise all the stuff and for last fifteen days before the exam I would just quickly review my notes. Okay, have you prepared notes along with videos? Yeah, I did prepare notes along with the videos. Yeah. Okay, means you just... you will pass the video and write the notes like that. Yeah. like if i feel like this point i won't remember like most of the points that the teacher or the mentor was writing on the board i used to write it in used my to write course. very yeah. good very good so uh, you have completed almost two times with a uh, speed to x etc yeah. in the second time you said no no have, i uh, just watched the videos one time uh, second time i went through my notes and if i had any doubts i would go okay. through the okay then you'll go yeah. through the videos very good yeah. good approach very good yeah. approach uh see you said uh, per day to mm-hmm. x speed something how many hours yeah yeah so i in the start like the first two months i did four hours four, four hours video okay. it yeah, completed in two hours right yeah then uh, i increased my speed up i did almost the videos for 5 to 6 hours so it completed for me in 3 hours yeah very good okay. and yeah it in that phase only i went i never did over did it because i didn't want to i say uh, like put all all this information in my head and then if i forget everything then there is no use so i wanted to like just limit myself till that thing that i am able to remember not overdo it have you followed nptel lectures or anything else apart from yeah NPTL? i followed nptel lectures for algorithms and data okay. structures i like them very much so i did it okay. it is very yeah. beautifully explained on their youtube in videos. nptel also yeah yeah algorithms and data structure very good yeah. very good suggestion you have given to your juniors also um, uh-huh. see what advice you will give to the future aspirants whether they have to start at second year or third year also what session you will give yeah i didn't start in second year i didn't start in third year so i have no such suggestion like if you actually want to do higher studies then only pursue it and if you have a goal in mind then two years three years don't matter i did it in 10 11 months so it it's just the it's just what you are trying to put in like if you do two years and in ev- on every day you are only watching you are only studying for one hour then i don't think it would be sufficient if you want to put in uh, if you want to have a goal like i want to do this gate in this this year then you have to make a strategy okay how much i will have to study and how i will approach the exam so yeah okay very good very good we have one general question see nowadays particularly computer science students they get some campus placements of 3 lakh 4 lakh let it be 5 6 lakh yeah. then they are just stopping the preparation for gate exam but yeah. even see the worst case you got placed yeah. you worked for 2 yeah. years so what motivated yeah. you to do mtech what motivated you to do mtech uh actually I, uh, my job was very interesting like it was a lot of development and coding and stuff but uh, like it's a cycle like you start you do the coding and then you do the deployment so i was like is there something more to computer than only this so that's why i wanted to explore the future fields in which i am actually interested so i thought i was very confused i wanted to do gre as well i wanted to do gate as well so then i just uh, weighed in my pros and cons and decided on i'll do the gate thing so that's why just to explore more stuff in computer i wanted to do, do this i appreciate yeah. you yours is a right decision yours is a right yeah. decision doing mtech in iit is particularly for computer science yeah. you will have very better future 
because i have seen some of our students even getting 7 8 lakhs package in the campus also they joined iit bombay chennai etc now they are very happy no regrets for them so so your decision is an appropriate decision see you don't go for ps us na see some csc toppers also saying that we want to join okay. psc do you have any such idea yeah. join psc public sector undertaking no i don't think like as of now i, I just did to do it because i wanted to study more so okay. i don't think i will limit myself to the job right okay. now i will go for the further okay. studies yeah i think you have followed the as study material also have you followed as study materials apart from yeah yeah. yeah 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 so i so, ordered that yeah actually have ordered that also see yeah, apart yeah. from the study material and videos and test series whether a student requires any additional textbooks for preparation for gate exam i feel like there are two types of student मटेरियल Mm-hmm. See these online coaching, like pre-recorded deep learn or mm-hmm. online live classes, mm-hmm. have started. Mm-hmm. What is the relevance? Do you think that these courses, online courses, will be useful to the student? I would say it was very useful to me because I was also doing a job on the side, wow. so I was not able to join. to a very specific time like 5 you have yes. to join because may Correct. i may have a call that time Correct. so the deep learn was good for me because it was like it was available to me all the time i didn't have to wait for someone to upload yes. or some yeah yes so you can have your own schedule you are the yeah. boss you are the boss exactly yeah so for classroom coaching or live classes you have to be available at a particular slot Mm-hmm. Yeah. So for a working class or any other, I think definitely this will be very much useful. Very good. Mm-hmm. Okay. So finally, Ms. Bhumika, what is your suggestion to your juniors? Finally. So, if actually really you want to crack it, then you have to be very consistent. Like you have to put in the efforts. You can't just go there and take anything and you will get marks. That's not the case in it because. is this time as well the msqs were difficult they were lengthy the paper was lengthy so you oh, have to put in lengthy. the hard yeah you have to put in the hard work and uh, what we can say is you have to give your best like every time you give a test you may not score very well but you have to keep going like if this is not the correct like i also scored low in some of the test and i was very low at that point but okay. then i was like okay you can move forward this is not the final exam the final yes. exam is the main exam so don't be demotivated by anything i okay. would say that because there may be many times like you are not getting a concept and you feel like like you should just give it up but that's not the case like because you should gate, keep yeah. because gate is a relative exam you need not feel so much yeah. pressure in the exam yes yeah. so if there is something is tough for you it is equally mm-hmm. tough for others. yeah exactly so you have overcome all such pressures okay mm-hmm. so you in the exam yeah. hall also i think you wrote the exam in a very mm-hmm. cool and calm environment i won't say cool and calm because for the starting 15 minutes i was like oh my god what is this paper and the <laughs> questions are shuffled for everyone right yes, so yes. in font also the first question i got was very lengthy so uh-huh. i was like oh, what am i doing like First uh, five minutes, you have to answer one question. What are you gonna do for that? Okay. So I was not very cool for the starting fifteen minutes. Fifteen minutes. minutes. But then, okay. Yeah. F- fifteen to twenty minutes, I was not at all cool. But then I was like, okay, if you are, if you lose your calm right now, then the whole paper would be like this. So I just gave like two seconds of thought. I drank water and then I started uh-huh. again. And then I was like, okay, yeah. Okay, this is this you know, so you will do it. This you don't know, leave it now. 
And okay. the next time, once I did the whole slot, then I again came to some questions, and then I was able to solve some of the questions which I learned. Not all, but some of the questions. Yeah. Okay. Finally, you made it yours. <laughs> yeah. Okay. okay. Yeah. Congratulations, Bhumika. God bless Thank you. Thank you. Regards to your parents also on behalf Thank of you. Yeah, Ace sure. Engineering Academy. Okay. Sure. Yeah. Ace Engineering Academy and Ace Deep Learn or Ace Online. Okay. Sure. Thank you. Yeah. God bless Thank you. you. God bless you. Thank you. Bye.